First Derby, do you kind of know what to expect if people told you about uh, what's going to go on? I have no idea what to expect, to be quite honest. I've just heard it's the most insane party. You have to come. Everyone that, I've had a few friends that have, have come. I've, I've had friends from Louisville that said it's just incredible. So we, we had the opportunity to make it out. And We've so. heard to be wary of the mint juleps. Oh, the mint yeah. Yeah, they can hit you. On you. Yeah. Yeah, they can sneak up on you a little bit. Have you had a chance to, uh, I guess, experience Louisville? How have you been in town? We, we yeah, actually just got today. here yesterday. We were in Lexington uh, visiting UK. A friend of mine's a professor there. And uh, then we went to the, the Buffalo Trace Distillery today and had this great tour. And it was, it was amazing. It's uh, funny. So what's the trick, by the way, to picking a horse? Everybody's giving us all these little insights. The only, the only trick is to pretend like you know what you're talking about because oh. nobody actually knows. And I do this with my wife. I take her up there and you just look at the book and you're like, oh, that one, yeah, ran fast last time. Yeah. <laughs> I heard to get the mud runner. Yeah, exactly. it's going to be yeah. wet. And I don't even know if that's true, but you convincingly sold that to me, so I'm going with it. I don't know if it's true or not. Pretend you know. Pretend yeah, you yeah. Know. The mud runner. Yeah. The mud runner. You know the one I'm yeah, talking about. Yeah, that one, the mud runner. Now, the other part of it, bourbon, horse racing, basketball. Do you get into the college basketball at all? Are you a big fan of the basketball? I'll answer that for him. Yes, he does. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I mean, I don't really, the, the sad part is I don't really have a team. I went to a performing arts college, yeah. so. But I do, I do watch every year, and I love March Madness, and to her chagrin, it's on 24 7. Sports Center. That yeah. dun dun yeah. every day. Well, you can jump on the Kentucky bandwagon. We'll let you on right now. Yeah, so officially, on. right now, you're in. I'll go with. I'll go with. I'll definitely. I'll jump on UK. Sure. Why not? <laughs> All right. Thank I'm you very okay. much, <laughs> Joey. Yeah. You're a veteran at this point of the Derby experience. What is it keeps you coming back to Louisville? You know, already? I'm getting old, but it's the beauty of it. You know, it's kind of a, no. You know what? I think it's just a Southern hospitality. It's a lot of fun. You come year after year. It's it's a great event. It's great. You know, obviously with Barcelona Brown Gala. As far as donating money for diabetes, which is great, great cause. And we just love to donate our time and come out it because it's just such a great event year after year. And of course, who doesn't love the Derby? I mean, do you, in, in all your years coming here, they tried to pull you Kentucky or Louisville basketball one side or the other? They tried to. No, they never tried to tell me. They haven't pulled me anywhere yet. And then uh, just, I, I plead the fifth. Yeah. Now you are a derby pro at this point, right? You've been to a lot of derbies. What, for people that don't come here and experience this, what, what's it like? Oh boy, well it's uh, it's it's overwhelming, I would say, a little bit, because it's uh, you know, you uh, it's not the kind of thing you can get used to, I guess. It's uh, it's a bit crazy, it's a bit uh, over the top. There's a lot of pump and circumstance, but it's all part of the atmosphere. Feel like we're on Downton Abbey. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of like Even fancy I'm fancy. Like we're in Downton Abbey. I am. Yeah, I am. Yeah. No, it's uh, it's good fun though. Yeah, it's fun. But well, this is my first derby, and. Uh, it's outrageous. Yeah. I've been to Keeneland. I was at Keeneland last year, uh, but this is just insane. Uh, I've never, I, I haven't seen this many drunk people since the last Lindsay Lohan party I was at. <laughs> I, I've actually never been invited to a Lindsay Lohan party. So. <laughs> Has anybody told you kind of what to expect? Did you talk to people about what's, go, what's going to go well, on? They said or? it's going to be a lot of drunk people, yeah. so they delivered on that promise. <laughs> you a big basketball fan? Are they trying to sell you on it while you're here? I only follow horses I don't have I'm not a sports guy I don't follow yeah. a team I don't I don't have, it's only horses yeah, only horse it, yeah it consider you play Gordon Bombay and Mighty Ducks only horse I don't even follow the Ducks I'm sorry Ducks <laughs> no are they in the playoffs I, I have no idea I don't follow hockey yeah <laughs> Stoops has got everybody fired up about football are you looking forward to what he's putting I, I out there I cannot wait cannot wait I'm telling you man it's uh, it's gonna be awesome and Look out, baby. Look out. And are you on the basketball side, do you, are you talking undefeated season? I mean, a lot of people talk that. Or you just want to see you what they can do on the floor? You know what's so awesome is we won it two years ago, a little bit won it this year, and it's coming back to Kentucky that next year. So, I mean, we are the basketball state. Make sure that North Carolina and all the rest of it, we are the basketball state. You know, my wife and I have been coming here for 15 years, and we've been a part of the, the Barnstable Brown Gala and the Derby and the Oaks for 15 years. And this has become such a great thing for us because Louisville has accepted us into this area as like we were from here. And I was born and raised in Georgia, but I feel like a native here. Do you get caught up in the race? Like, do you have a favorite horse, or is it just about going to the Derby? I don't be knowing, man. They ask me, I'd say I'm going to the Derby, and they start telling the favorites and yeah. all of that. I, what I usually do is just bet on, I say, what's the worst horse? Yeah. And I bet my money on that yeah, one. And then if you win, well, you I did on. that one time in my life. This was like years ago. I went to the track with my friend. He was like, come on, go hang in the track. Good food. So we went to the track. He was like, oh, I bet. I put $1 on a long shot. He led the whole race, and my friend was pissed off because he was like, don't you know if you would have put $100 yeah. on it? 
Well, that's, that's when you just stop, right? You just drop the mic and walk away. Yeah, then you don't yeah, bet anymore. Exactly, after yeah, that, right? after that, yeah, <laughs> exactly. Get up from the table, yeah. walk away from the cards. Yeah. Now, every, everything is about horse racing, of course, and then basketball is the other part of it. You get yeah. into the college basketball, Kentucky, yeah, Louisville. Louisville thing. I love you. Yeah, it's a rivalry it's though. A big rivalry, yeah. Cause y'all Kentucky and they're Kentucky. Yeah. They call Kentucky, yeah. but y'all call Louisville, but y'all Kentucky too. Yeah. You have, so y'all have fight to see who's going to re represent for Kentucky. And, and it's been back and forth. Two championships yeah, yeah, in a row. Yeah. Calipari, it's Patino. Exciting. It's better that way. Yeah. Going back and forth. I don't have one favorite over the other. But I should say Louisville because I'm in Louisville yeah. right now. <laughs> Do you think the college athletes, the last thing, they should be paid? I mean, there's a lot of talk about I getting I think them. they should be paid. Yeah, they should be paid. Yeah. They're earning it for sure. Thank you, sir. For, yeah, appreciate it. bringing yeah. some loot in. Yeah. They, <laughs> pay them. You know, find a, a nice little level. Of, look, they pay the coaches. Yeah. And the coaches don't even play, but they coach, I understand, so pay the players too. Well, Calipari's here, so maybe you can you talk to him about yeah, that. I'm a, yeah, I'm going to speak to Calipari tonight. <laughs> Go Louisville. <laughs>